Happy birthday, Cancer, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I certainly appreciate both your viewership as well as your subscriptions. So, Cancers, what I thought I'd do for you today is to, particularly for your first reading, I like to engage you in a bit of a financial discussion, okay? And we're just going to do a reading and see what Spirit has to say in regards to your financial situation. And ladies and re gentlemen, this reading is valid until the end of July. So it certainly gives you time with which to work with the energies. Always remember, if I say something to you that appears to be bleak, you are the captain of your own ship and you could redo the picture. Just examine whatever you're doing now to prevent or to minimize disaster, if you will. Rest assured, ladies and gentlemen, this reading certainly will not and may not resonate with each and every one of you out there. But for those for whom this reading is meant, I certainly hope it offers you the valuable information that you're seeking. So as you can see before you, I'm going to be using my conjure cards today in order to um, convey your message. And what i like to do is to share with you your overarching theme or motif if you will that's pervading the reading and then i'm going to share with you what i'm seeing that you might have already experienced in the past ladies and gentlemen and perhaps or you might be presently experiencing and what the future holds for you in terms of financial stability if you will okay all right so let's go on and get started here i'm shuffling up and as I said, we're going to start off with the overarching energy. And if this reading resonates, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Share it with others to whom you think might benefit, ladies and gentlemen. And be sure to press that subscription button so that each and every one of you receives future readings. Okay? So with that said, let's go on and just select cards here from the bottom. We have... Okay. The Jack of Clubs. Okay. The next card we have is. Wow. The Jack of Diamonds. My goodness, Cancer. And the next card we have. Wow. The Jack of Spades here. I haven't seen this combination in a long time. And rest assured, Cancer, that it means something here. Okay, so let's start off with just making a few general observations and then I'm just going to give you a consolidated story so you can follow and to hopefully understand there. Now, when you have those three jacks there, it certainly shows, ladies and gentlemen, that there are false friends around you, okay? It could, it include, it could be at least three people. And it's not on a friendship type level here, so... Of course, the scope of this reading is not romantic, but had it been, or if you are involved in that situation, it doesn't appear to be as rosy as you would hope it to be. But with this, I'm seeing a lot of false friends surrounding you. I'm seeing a lot of quarrels, a general combative type atmosphere that I'm seeing here. Someone, again, I see that you can't be, you can't trust this person. I'm seeing a lot of instability. Um, particularly with your financial situation as well as unsettled circumstances and it could be an earth sign that's doing this or that you can't trust whomever it is a the person appears to be a bit immature and younger than you that i'm kind of getting here and sometimes this combination brings about a, an imprisonment for someone i don't believe it's you um, per se cancer but it's, it's someone younger you know it could be even with these cards it could be a uh, uh, someone that's very young i'm getting here someone again that's very very immature and of course you see this one eye jack here or this jack here and you see that this jack is all about mischievousness being mischievous you know and just doing things against your better judgment here Spirit is telling me to tell you with this combination, ladies and gentlemen, you really need to try, I'm, or just looking at your, your cards here, that you need to not allow things to blow out of 
sync or proportion when it comes to your financial situation. I'm also seeing an accident or some type of danger or termination for someone. Someone might have recently lost a job or something of that nature here, but these cars are signaling that something new is on the horizon. I'm also seeing two ladies and gentlemen, while this is kind of not within scope, but it could be for some of you because it affects your financial situation. I'm seeing an abortion possibly for some of you, a miscarriage, or, or some of you may uh, endure a C-section, a or some type of in uterus type surgery that I'm seeing here. Um, for you ladies out here, it has a strong possibility, okay? I'm also seeing a lot of letters, visits, phone calls, and possibly help forthcoming, ladies and gentlemen, from a male, okay? So I'm seeing a very challenging financial outlook that seems to be ahead for you guys, but I feel that you're going to certainly, in the final analysis, a small sum of money is forthcoming, you know? And I'm also seeing, too, that Some of you, it seems that you, you're going to be feeling a bit trapped. But again, okay, the, the, you know, you, the sun certainly is going to shine again here, okay? Spirit is showing me a lot of pointing the fingers uh, in regards to your situation. And I'm getting a strong indication that some of you might even be a little bit immature with your finances as well. And you might need to establish... Um, a payment arrangement here because I'm seeing it either it's like bill collectors or someone who you owe money I'm got I'm gathering here and this will resolve some of the difficulties that you're having here okay but I certainly see some type of financial crisis arising ladies and gentlemen and you know but it looks like that but for those of you who are seeking employment somehow i do see that some of you are going to be getting a part-time job i'm seeing or you're just going to have a fresh start perhaps in a new direction here but again i have to warn you to you know to be you know not to be reckless with your spending embrace a new beginning as well as new opportunities here also, I'm getting a strong sense that it seems that someone owes you money. And this person, it seems, perhaps has been giving you the runaround. Which you're, you've are been worried about or you're going to be worried about. And I'm seeing some type of a legal or financial notice that you're going to receive in the mail here. It's some, it seems like it's something... Like, again, it's, it's, it looks like it's a notice I'm getting of some sort here. All right? So that's quite a bit here for overarching energies that are seeming to be coming into your realm. So what I like to do, I'm going to pull a card to just represent your past here. While wow, we have the nine of clubs there. So that kind of further emphasizes or that shows still a lot of tur you know financial turbulence okay i feel that it looks like i feel that many of you are, or most of your money came from a, it looks like a business or of your own or something that you utilize your talents or something gained from your talents i'm getting However, ladies and gentlemen, I also feel that there was a, again, in your past showing, and it could have been a fire sign here, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, that it looks like it, they were a con artist I'm getting, or, you know, and a lot of people did very crafty things to you, or perhaps some of you got involved with people who were involved with that without knowing but this person certainly had malicious intent. And some of you might have, even I'm getting a sense, possibly you got scammed or invested in something that you really shouldn't because you didn't really, really, you know, look deeply into it before moving forward, I'm getting. Um, 
it looks like that the investment perhaps for some of you it, it looks it was very low and dishonest here but whatever money you made it looks like it really came from your own talents that I'm getting here and some of you might even have you might have worked in like the import or export type bit um, business or you a trading type business or you wanted a career in that area that I'm kind of feeling here okay if this reading is resonating be sure to give it a big thumbs up share it with others to whom you think might benefit and be sure to press that subscription button okay so let's go on and just pull your remaining cards here and it's represent your future okay and again this reading is valid until July so I'm gonna go on and just pull out a few more cards we have the king of diamonds Wow the wish card the nine of hearts the king of clubs so ladies and gentlemen right off the bat you certainly can see that your situation is going to improve in some way we have the eight of spades okay we have the ace of hearts and let's pull one final card here oh another king so let's just make a few observations and we can certainly start with the combinations here we see that there are well, first of all, let's look at the cards. It's the, the the cards here anyway. You have a predominance basically of high cards there, so that suggests that certainly a lot of news of communication is going to be coming through for you guys. And I'm seeing that you know you're certainly you're, you're about to to go experience. I'm getting major changes, and these changes somehow, Cancer will influence your life greatly i'm kind of getting here i'm seeing here let's start with these kings here you have three there so it certainly shows significant meetings important financial news or business news is certainly um, on the way here and it gives you this feeling ladies and gentlemen of a major breakthrough so your financial breakthrough despite all odds is just around the corner okay and for you men out there, I mean, I see with the, those kings there, that could um, denote that you're going to be make, meeting more male friends. And it seems to be more strictly like business type contacts or, you know, or um, you're going to be, I'm seeing as well for you women out there that there's also going to be a chance for a, you know, romantic improvement here showing there. And also meeting good contacts good people here that could also help you with your business okay and I'm also seeing here that I'm seeing new cash flows coming in new revenues all right I'm seeing you guys gonna be receiving a lot of invitations I'm getting here to go to different parties or gatherings I'm seeing you partying I'm also seeing you're getting intoxicated, so you might want to kind of do things in moderation here, <laughs> okay? But I also see you meeting is going to be a very uncertain type connection. It could be a business connection for some of you, a romantic connection with a very popular individual that I'm getting here who happens to be very promiscuous. I'm also seeing an older man seeming to come into the picture here who appears to be very wise and mature. And then you have those two nines there, ladies and gentlemen. So that certainly, you know, um, further emphasizes the fact that, you know, what I said from the bottom energy, that there, there is going to be a small gain or some minor business-related contract agreement that is going to come from that. I don't see any, like, big big games coming in but you're going to feel that whatever it is that comes through for you is going to be a breakthrough because of all of the um, challenges ladies and gentlemen that you've been kind of going through here so understand that there might be a slight setback but i see you doing something also connected with your 401k and some of you might even be doing things with stocks or even with your retirement here but at the, in the final analysis, it looks like that, again, for those of you in a business of your own, I do see a lot of people coming back and forth, you know, for your services. But you certainly have to be aware of people's irritating behavior and be aware of a snake who might be, 
who is surrounding you here. So it could be in conjunction with your business for some of you. Or just, just watch out and keep a watchful eye. So with that said, Cancer, this is your reading. I certainly hope that it has offered food for thought. Be sure to like and share. Subscribe if you've yet to subscribe. And should anyone wishes to have a more personalized reading, you can certainly access my website to schedule or to purchase. And now, Cancer, I will be posting a more extended reading, okay? And it will require your membership, so have a watchful eye. I intend to put up a very good exciting readings for you guys so watch out for those coming your way so once again cancer thanks a lot for your time and veering and i look forward to hearing your comments enjoy your day now thanks a lot